in the left corner. Hailing from Wizards of the Coast. The team of Nate, the Hatchling Price, Blake Rasmussen, Maria Bartholi, and a woman whose name I can't remember. Sorry to that woman. In the right corner, the one we cheer for every week, the underdog. Oh, and four lifetime against Nate by himself. The crowd favorite. Useful information. Who will be victorious? Spoiler alert, folks. We are useful information wins this match. Useful information wins the freaking match because they gave us a date for the NDA drop. After that point in the stream, there's almost no information. This is the same Maria, right? They didn't say her last name, but it looked the same and her voice sounded the same. This is Giggling Maria, right? And Megan, who... I don't, I've never really seen before. I've seen Maria, you know, on the streams. But I hadn't seen Megan, so I didn't know how to look up her face. So she did not get represented in this picture. Let's get to it. Yeah, uh, let's talk about that in a sec, California. Hello, everybody! Hello. Welcome to uh, our super awesome Wednesday MTG Arena stream. As First of all, their mics are too hot. Too hot. They're already distorting. You have learned, uh, I am not alone today. I have the wonderful Me. and incomparable Blake Rasmussen here sitting next Hi, everyone. Uh, Blake is the content manager behind Daily MTG, so uh, if you have liked the things that we've been doing over the last, you know, how long has it been since you kind of changed up when Daily was doing the things that it was doing? Uh, Daily really went under its facelift in November, so it's only been about three months. Cool. Three point. months? Well, he was the architect behind it, so if you like what you've seen on Daily MTG recently, uh, you I've can I've never seen Blake. Daily MTG. He's a cool dude. Um, this week we do have some things to talk through. Uh, I know that you guys have been clamoring for news and I keep telling you, I don't have any, and then just brush you off till next week. It is <laughs> not by design, like it is just nice how things job. have gone. I have more news today, uh, which we will get to over the course of the stream. Uh, part of the reason Blake is here today, in addition to the fact that um, I have a super sweet deck that I will not delete, that I want him to get an opportunity to get behind the uh, the wheel of. It's pretty sweet. Um, he plays it wrong. I, it's important because I, I'm going to be out of town next week, and I need someone to fill in for me on our weekly streams, and I'm going to have Blake do it, and so I wanted to give him an opportunity to get in and get a little bit I have my here. sweater ready. Um, I was actually really surprised you weren't wearing them today, like, because I, I, I actually, didn't... All right, before we get into a deep sweater conversation, this is the guy who's streaming next week for us. I miss Nate. I don't like this guy as much as Nate. want us to wear exactly the same thing. I specifically thing. wore this one because I knew that you also have like one of the like gray I'm, cardigans. I'm and not going to lie, I held it in my hand for a while <laughs> this morning as I was getting dressed. And I thought, you know what, it's just in case I don't want to match. Oh, super. Uh, I agree, you know, Shark. Okay. You, just, like, you can Morrow slide right would be out of control. Like, there's gotta be, we have to uh -huh. maintain sweater continuity uh, well, on this stream, very otherwise it's stream. very clear that it's uh -huh. not like, you know, an arena stream. That's how people know. <laughs> Uh, just don't steal my thing, man. Like it's me. Like <laughs> only, only, only when you're not here. It's reasonable. That's very reasonable. Me I'll get too. You huge glasses to wear too. You can just. Thanks. We'll just pretend that you're me. That'll get some um, viewers. You can't shave. Oh, actually, that wouldn't matter. Uh, I you can't pull that shave. off. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, to give you guys a look towards next week's stream, um, we're actually gonna we're gonna do something a little bit special because we have our big March milestone update coming up uh, next week. It'll be next Thursday. We'll be bringing the servers down, and there's a whole bunch of stuff that's going into that, but uh, rather than just tell it all to you today, I'm going to wait until next week because we've got Chris Clay. Chris Clay hype. On the stream. Um, and he's actually Hopefully he will hold the stream together. All the sweet stuff that is next in week. Uh, and uh, he'll be battling against Blake here mm -hmm. next week. So uh, I wanted to make sure that Blake got 
you know, a little bit extra practice. Clay I mean, hype uh, in chat, on the please. Camera that guy's that awesome. On Clay's, got you. Clay, Clay's played against me on the stream before. So I'm comparatively like, a novice. Yeah. Um, and he'll have information about all that. For those of you guys who were in the chat asking earlier, yeah, there's there's an account wipe that is associated with these big major updates, or oh, at least shard. this particular Too major soon. update. So uh, that's coming along. And Too soon, Other shard. than that, um, there is a really other cool thing that we're doing. Um, we're bringing the servers down. It'll be next Thursday. And then when they come up, you guys can start streaming. So that is when uh, the NDA drops. Oh, my goodness. I mean, we spoiled it already, folks, but NDA drop is next Thursday. That's it, folks. After this point in the stream, you will get no useful information, but more more acting like, look at Blake and Nate right now down here. Blake's doing the home alone. Nate's doing the, uh, I don't have, take my wallet, dude, I guess is what you'd call it. Anyways, there's not much more to say. We discussed it earlier. I'm I'm excited. Like I didn't quite see a Merfolk player huge. I didn't quite summarize my feelings about Art Direction and Lift, but I want to stream it. Like truthfully, why the most part I'm excited for is the free time. If you're a parent with kids, you have basically lost all your free time, which I know seems weird since I'm streaming every day. But you lose a lot of free time. And I am so excited to get back basically three hours of free time a day. I don't know who Chris Klein is. Like, the fact that I don't have to grind this game offline, that I can do it online, streaming, is incredible to me. It means I get to have more time with my family. It means I get to have more time playing music. It means I have more time to sleep. More time to stream more. Like, I just the things I could do with more free time, I don't give a F about the art direction, comparatively. It's just going to be so nice. So, yeah, like you, Ninja, all the streamers can agree. So that's why I'm up for the NDA lift. I would still be happy to wait a day to make sure the patch works fine, but I'm up for it. Can't tell you how much I need this free time. I mean, I'll get more games in. I've been playing like five games a day some days, sometimes less. Just don't have the time. I don't have the time to stream and play the game behind the scenes. Yeah, not using Mana Stack. I mean, shout out to Mana Stack, but it'll be much more fun to build decks on stream. And it's also be fun to just not have to shut my mouth or think about what's going to come out of it. Or shush people in chat for like saying something that I think is against the NDA. It'll just you just say whatever you want. It'll be cool. You can talk about the forums openly. Talk about everything openly. Um, yes, Ninjo. Same time, but I'm probably going to try to stream more. I'm probably going to try to stream more at night, maybe in the afternoon. Like, I might, you know, I might have to step on other streamers' toes. We'll see how it goes. I know you like to kind of wait for everybody to be done to have your own thing, but for a while there, I'll probably just be going crazy trying to stream morning, midday, and night for a little while. Anyway, let's get on with the show. So, yeah, as soon as we come back from uh, the downtime on the it's 22nd, right? Like, I've been yep. doing this Thursday for long the, enough. Thursday the 22nd. All right, Thursday the 22nd. Thursday the 22nd. All right, sweet. There will be, the NDA is going to drop. You guys can go out and start streaming and making your videos and doing all your sweet stuff. And um, actually, literally, like, five minutes before we started the stream, break, uh, Blake pressed uh, play on an article that I wrote. They let me write words, everyone. <laughs> Sometimes. And uh, it is outlining all of the I information like the about the article. It's a pretty good drop, writer. Um, including no some really cool stuff that we're doing style. with these things we call them uh, creator kits. Mm -hmm. We have... We, we, basically, these are the we, overlays we talked we about already. We continue to grow the magic streaming and uh, video content creation community. Um, we've, got, we've had a 
relatively small pool of very dedicated, highly enfranchised creators and like really, really love all the work that everybody's put into this. We want to be able to try to make things easier for people who are new to get into uh, content creation. We want to give them a leg up. And so we've uh, included a downloadable set of screens and overlays for uh, streamers. Uh, as well as a best practices guide about how to get started making uh, videos. You guys read the best practice guide? From the wisdom of some of our biggest influencers. Really, really cool. And uh, you guys should go to it is at magic.wizards.com. I'm considering going over it on drop. stream, but. Read my awesome article. Uh, it is. This is awesome. Here, it's right here. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's uh, where you get the creator kits, article, people, the overlays and things, stuff. And uh, download those content creator kits because we want you guys to get out there and start streaming as soon as you can. So uh, that is that is that is that. How we give people an opportunity again. Like one thing I want to say, and I call it out in the article. Like, please don't do anything that involves content that you are collecting prior to next Thursday. So don't like. Record the this was noted, I think, on Ninja's stream or my stream yesterday. Videos. Like any of the content that, anything that features game content that comes before the NDA actually drops is stuff you guys can't use. It's so gone. Erase it. Because I don't like having to tell people to take things down. But I didn't even know who half those streamers were. I only know who Gabby know was and the professor. So, uh, do all that the stuff. The other guys, I have no um, idea who they are. I will not, like, I'm not going to dive into I can't into believe we weren't invited to speak, Ninja and you and me. Like I said, Clay is the right person to run through that. So. We will get to that uh, next week when he's here with Blake. Yep, and I just confirmed the article is live. So if you typed in that link, uh, it should work. Sweet. And uh, you should be able to get all the information from Nate's written hand. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yeah, and definitely get out there. There's a whole bunch of sweet stuff. Uh, there are great tutorials for all sorts of stuff if you're looking for streaming apparatuses and uh, like video content creation tools, those kinds of things. Uh, scour the internet. Become yeah, huge. I also don't know about that wizard IP content. stuff. Looking forward to seeing what you guys have come up with. So. And community stuff. You that, some of that um, stuff's kind of weird. We've got a little bit of additional stream news also. I'm going to you know, tease mm -hmm. it right now. You can tell more details next week if you want yeah, to but Justin. But I, think, on, I thought uh, I watched the big of, MTGO we streamers, so I don't know who those other guys were. Presence. We're actually kind of putting the It wasn't Kenji. It wasn't Caleb. into motion right now. And one of the pieces of that is a community-focused uh, show that Blake is putting together. Yeah, so uh, we've been working on this for a while. This is actually an idea we've had for a long time. Uh, but with the expansion of arena content that we've been doing, uh, we're looking to expand just more magic content in general. So uh, next Thursday, actually the same day as the NDA drop, uh, we're going to be having a stream uh, with uh, myself and Ethan Fleischer and Dave Humphreys to talk about Dominaria. Uh, that's going to be happening at 2.30 p.m. on Thursday the 22nd uh, Pacific time. And then uh, from there, uh, we won't be starting it immediately, but we're looking at uh, sometime probably in May launching Is a this guy too pretty for you guys? We'll feature guests from Wizards of the Coast. I don't like Coast how much time he spends on his hair. Scenes, uh, and we talk about what's happening and we give a little more insight into what's going on with with R&D, with creative, uh, with whatever's happening at that time. Uh, we're still kind of in the early stages of that, cool. so uh, things are liable to change here and there, uh, but we're hoping to launch a show sometime in May. Sweet, and as we manage to get that up. This is maybe a cool idea. You think you guys will be watching the show about like random magic topics? I feel like as long as they title them properly, I'll probably watch some with people I care about, and there'll be others that I'll have no interest in at all. Just because they stream MTGO doesn't mean they have unlimited money. I don't think that's a fair assumption. I mean, what do you guys think about like a random community show that hangs out with some developers and talks with them? Seems okay. Doesn't seem something I'll go out of my way to do, but I bet you there could be some interesting ones. It'll be good good stuff to talk about on stream, probably. I mean, it's kind of fun for us to be able to talk about this in a closed beta stream, considering we're going to want feedback. Like, obviously, yep. like you said, this is going to, we might change some stuff up. Things are going to grow and let people let us know what you think. So, yeah. All right. Um, well, we've talked enough. I've seen, like, well, we're going to go in and we're going to play some magic now, if that's all right. It's about you. time. All right. Uh, do, you want, yeah. do you want to, 
like, I kind of want to, do you, do you want to just battle first? Do you want to just jump straight on in and play <laughs> the best deck on uh, MTG Arena? Deck. The do not delete deck? You know, I mean, <laughs> do <laughs> not delete hype? What I call sure, the sure, let's do it. This deck is, so, I'm going to, this guy, this guy misplays do not delete. Don't screw my he does not then. slam ra <laughs> raptor hatch lane. <laughs> which... So, I am, I'm, I'm actually relatively new to uh, MTG Arena. I have only played a little bit. It's okay. Um, so I'm going to screw some things up against Shillis. Don't worry, it's okay. I mean, there, there are a couple things you should know. Uh, Spacebar is uh, your F2. This is how you move yep. through quickly. Uh, shift Enter roughly skips until you have a thing to do. Okay. Uh, until your opponent gives you a thing to do. This hand is... Okay. This is a problem. And I'm going to talk about it more later when the, when the grills come on the screen. But that Nate has to explain these buttons to Blake... And they're releasing this game. I guess it's still not open to the public, so maybe it's okay. But um, this should this stuff should be in there. And I love how he says "Shift Enter" roughly skips till you have to play something because it doesn't always work. Fine. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's, are, are we on the? I, we are. I'm okay, totally so. with you, Ninja. <laughs> I bet you I have one right. from my pre-release. We're just going to see what happens here. Cool. Oh, my God. I want I'm that, gonna, too, Ninja. Take this opportunity to... I didn't know I wanted it until you told me. The chat stuff. Trick says one day he'll be cool enough to stream with Blake. I did want to pull this up. I meant to discuss this. I think we ran out of time. We're going to take a quick pause for Nate's top five. This... This list changes every week. Number one, I think, is Grim Captain's Call. Number two, Raptor Hatchling. Number three, Sailor of Means. Number four, Hostage Taker. Not really sure what number five is. Chart a course. Chart the course. I think this is kind of where Nate stands right now. He doesn't really mention Hostage Taker, but he loves Hostage Taker. He's got four of He plays them all the time. I think that's where we're at at Nate's top five. We've streamed together already. That has happened. That's nice. You're trying to play the pity card. He I does, but friend. then he defends Grim Captain's Call to the <laughs> Death. Not going to work. Uh, so that's, people are asking that's about. That's really bad for me. Okay. Sailor of Means uh, is moving up on the list, but I don't know if he's yeah, into the whatever. two or yeah, one slot. I mean, that card is just really bad for the few. Yeah. He yeah, exaggerates no, no, a lot. That's just bad. That card's just terrible really bad. for me. Yeah. Especially because especially I love this card and was hoping. Oh, okay. Raptor Hatchling. No, this is fine. Uh, this deck is still like. This matchup isn't the greatest matchup because... No, he doesn't uh, slam it. Kill, slam it! Uh, ...your Raptor Hatchlings, and you don't get value out of them as much. Ah. But... That's a huge mistake. You always slam ra Raptor Hatchling and do not delete. Huge mistake. It is... Uh, I've, pl I've played this a few times. They're slow, you're slow, and you have the better late game than they do. Great. So. But, uh, let's see. Anyway, people asking Still about not playing Raptor there's Hatchling. a life coming. Yes. There what the will hell's be going on here? Coming. Uh, we are going to be... Um, he could have done two damage already. ...giving players a new set of starting cards, effectively. Um, basically, you get pre-constructed decks as opposed to just getting a selection of cards from the set or, like... You know, three of the commons, two of the uncommons, one of the rare, whatever whatever we gave people uh, for the last account wipe. This will actually be starting people off with pre-constructed decks. And so um, do we want to be able to see, this is a little bit more in line with what we expect the new player experience to be um, in terms of, like, having your account. New player experience itself is something that's on Pretty the road. sure I just skipped my turn. So there you go, folks. I was talking about this yesterday about getting the free rares and uncommons and commons. It looks like we're going to all start with pre-cons. <laughs> Hold up, counter spell to protect Atlin. Blake is 
Blake is effing up, man. Not having that ratchling, raptor hatchling out there is garbage. Um, Precons, eh? That means you're going to see a lot of the same damn decks at the beginning of this wipe. But one of the precons might be vamps. And I'm kind of with Ninjo. And going for vamps early. There's only about seven rares in that deck. And it's a very strong deck. And I'm enjoying playing it right now. So I'm kind of hoping for a vamp precon. But that just means everybody's going to be playing it. It'll be interesting to see. He could have used Hostage Taker on Phoenix. Well, that's a little scary without being able to hold up counter magic, actually. When I used to play Hostage Takers all the time, I used to definitely try to leave open two mana for the counter spell. So I, I think it's a little early to go after Hostage Taker. I, I'm okay with him countering this. Anyways, who knows what the precons will be, but I think it'll be kind of boring until we start acquiring cards, and we'll see how fast we can do that. Correct, you do get to select <laughs> cards again. That is the whole point of the beta, is to test all of this stuff. And thank you, loyal and wonderful uh, beta testers, for helping us out. And cards and decks. Okay. <laughs> I mean, we just have to uh, see. Anyway. Um, yeah, I assume we get more than one precon. Uh, I assume we get like, like three or four. Decks? Uh, they will be but cards as well cards seems sweet. Are currently available in MTG Arena at the time of release. So I mean, the whole point is yes, finally gets this Raptor hatchling down. Are designed to be played against each other, um, and so there'll be there'll be a bunch for you to choose from. They'll have all. I think we'll, will we post on the deck lists. Um, yeah, we will be posting the deck lists in, like next week, week yeah. on the twenty second. We will post the full deck. Okay, list. Cool. there's a lot of so reading we're gonna have to do on Thursday. Like all, what is coming in the update next week. So, right? And yes. CGB. We will have the information basically the day before. There's too many other up. cards in the As new sets, those of though. You guys who have been in the closed beta know that's kind of how things are done for the beta right now. <laughs> Mostly because the beautiful thing about beta is there are literally a zillion things that we're working. See, this is what I was talking about. Tons <laughs> of stuff being worked on right now, and there's some things that will be like. He didn't counter you know, that. We know like I don't know if he could have. 99% of the things that are going to be in the update things he are going to change it. As, uh, as per te beta. So. And yes, we are obviously going to be working backwards uh, as far as sets go. We've told you guys we are most of the way done with uh, Amonkhet and Our Devastation. So um, more on that later. I want land here. That's not land. I'm super psyched I'm for that beard. Oh, you can that's play me. Eight, eight Sailor of Beans? Is that, is, that a, is that a thing? Is that actually letting you do that right now? I mean, I'm not one for exploiting. But, <laughs> <laughs> but Sailor of Beans... Is if, basically if there was my favorite any card. card you were going to let anybody <laughs> play a million of. That is one. It's up there on the list, California. Oh, I'm still not sure. Like, I think See, he's Fire exaggerating there. Great. The Fire Cannon <laughs> works here. That's going to happen. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see oh, if he'll oh. cast anything else. Omega B says everybody gets this. this like, my do not delete deck. I'm like, ah, it's like, in all fairness, there's. Freaking bees. I don't get it. I don't get why Nate responds to every question bees asks. But he did it again. Bees freaking did it again. He's like the Oracle of Nate. <laughs> That's gonna happen. I'm gonna I'm gonna see oh, if he'll oh. cast anything else. Omega B says everybody gets this, this like my do not delete deck. I'm like, ah, it's like in all fairness, there's no point in giving everybody access to this deck, otherwise there'd be no reason to build their own decks. When you're already given the best deck that you can build. <laughs> oh, you know what? He might have, cards have I have in my collection. crashed a raptor the hatchling there. Incomplete collection that I have. There you uh, go. Yeah. Incomplete collection. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know how Bees does it. Kinda, He's amazing. Uh, okay. Stabilized this year. Man, I'm really sad about that. I was really hoping to be able to. Looks like looks like it fails to save if you try to do that. I'm normally just not around okay, at that well, time. Good game. Like <laughs> my dishes are done and I'm off uh, doing something else. It is actually impossible for the second to be that hard. <laughs> okay. Like literally, like it is. <laughs> a nice like, shard. All right. Well, that's one way to get it done. Concede right now. Mm, I don't know what I'm. No, it's just. Uh, I mean, oh, it's oh look, failed to find. 
This is the problem with this deck is that I've been playing it so often recently that people know to metagame against it. All I need so, is like two more fiery cannonades and I'm fine. Uh, yeah. That's a funny joke. That is Nate's best joke in a long time. The people are metagaming do not delete. I think that's hilarious. Good on you, Nate. You know, that's, mm -hmm. that's cool. They're probably not going to play a second Carnage Tyrant anytime soon. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, no, I guess I could no throw a hostage to death to touch. Like... Who puts death touch in decks? Dude, Could don't hate on death block? touch. Poisoner's awesome. Uh, yeah, go ahead. I have no blockers. Yeah, you guys are on board. You know, you know about Nate. Oh, it's okay, Sans Serif. Yeah. We got the. There is a. Apparently, the for those of you guys who are in chat, feel free to spread the love on Watsi Admins. Done a job adding in the uh, NDA drop uh, command. So. Exclamation NDA, I'll give you the information. twice. Sideboarded the lead button. Maybe Failed I shouldn't have let you. I should have. Like, you're. Gosh, Blake. Blake, Blake. Blake's Blake. just not playing Blake. it right. He, I, I'm he thought is, Search would be good, but like really you should be slamming Raptor Hatchling. Instead, he's like holding up counter spells and trying to Search. It's not going well. <laughs> he's not using the <laughs> speed bumps. I mean, you gave me a deck that's dead to Carnage Tyrant, and then we immediately... Exclamation point advantage, Mar. <laughs> All right. I mean, Grixis control is a thing. Staff Monk, tier one joke. S-class. Like it. Sailor, mean, Sailor of Means yeah. is around we're, a lot. We're, we're, really, like, we're really... I mean, we're, we're technically, technically not dead. dead. <laughs> but we're real dead. Uh, that's oh, man. fine. I love this. Do you? You gonna do it again? Yeah, where's my Numat ghost? So, they clearly know what they clearly know what's up. Aha, there it is. Aha. Getcha, I guess. Go to one. Does does that does that count as as getting ya? No, that was on my turn. Oh. So even better. It's it's a little bit better. I'm still dead, but you know. Yeah. That's okay. I mean you're we are out of content, folks. It's more of this for the rest of the stream. Except there will be girls coming. It's a shame that Trample works the way Trample works. I know. It's a good point about Trample. Okay. Still not dead. And all his moment of cravings are gone, so... Yeah, how could he possibly... Oh, there we go, there we go. Yep, not dead. Not dead. Not dead. Sailor of yeah, Means, saving the day. I, if I, could. <laughs> I know, man. I know. The no, girls are coming. The grills no, will be you here. Can, it's, it's, you can choose and then say no, right? Can't leave the stream uh, now because you have no, to wait for it. Exile your gold token. <laughs> oh, it's yeah. No, don't, it's exactly. an auto exile. Yeah. I'll, goodbye, gold. Yep. All right. Well, <laughs> is that really how hostage taker is? That's <laughs> all right. Another Guess guy who doesn't know how the cards work, you know, streaming the game. Sweet. Really didn't. Didn't you? Don't you love Hostage Taker as a card too? I mean, no. it's no Cloud Blazer. It's no Cloud Blazer. It's what no Mall Drifter. What is? Eh. What's the deal with this guy and Cloud Blazer? I know Fresh Prince said something in chat. I gotta run to the bathroom real quick. Tell me what his connection is to Cloud Blazer, please. No one knows? All right. I think it's fine. There's so, he's related to Cloud Blazer somehow. Basically I don't know. Cloud Blazer, though. It is. You I mean, draw you, a... Uh, you gain a bunch oh, of life. Really? You can get I'm, two cards. I'm so dead. <laughs> <laughs> right yeah, on time. That is, that is too <laughs> late. 
All right, go ahead, let, wow. let your opponent attack. They might have a quest. All right. Be a, oh. be a good. Look at this guy. Nick, he's such a nice guy. Be a good. He's helping like out MPG other people with the quest. I don't do that. I'm, I'm down I with quit this. when I'm going to lose the game. <laughs> Whatever quest they have going on, they're hitting it. These games go on long <laughs> enough for me that I'm not going to sit around and uh, let people quest accomplish quests quest on my time. hard for this deck to do. You got to do that oh, on your own time. That's a pretty easy one. So. Yeah. I am not, I'm going to decline to block here. That's uh, I mean, your call. I think. So I, did, I didn't do the math, but it looks Ooh, like Oh, look at this. He's dropping rank. We. We going not, back to wood? Yeah, we didn't uh, didn't bother looking. Oh my at god! Look at that quest a, he has. Twenty lands. We'll get there. Yeah, what a sweet! That's the best there. quest in the game. Yeah. I got uh, that the other day. Me, you you, yeah, let me, you t let don't, me show don't let me touch you. it. Let me show anymore. you how it's done. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! This person's got a lot of adornments on their rank. Adornments. That's probably not good for us. Probably not. All right. So Nate is at the wheel now, playing his deck the way it should be played. Means Where you slam hatchling oh, when you get it. I'd be fine with that actually. <laughs> I tend to run pretty well against Merfolk with this guy. You know what? Fiery uh, Cannonade Merfolk probably does run pretty well against Merfolk. Not. They they are oh, not. Oh, this hand is so bad. Look at all the good stuff he's got though. Like, I can't uh, mulligan a double Sailor of Moon's hand. You can. Hand. Nope. You're on the draw. Nope. Keeping. <laughs> <laughs> so this this is how you always win with this deck? Yeah. Okay. Get there dot deck. Nate, uh, Blake's already starting to pick on my boy Nate. I don't like it. Who is that second sir dude on the stream? Uh, my name is Blake. Uh, if you didn't tune in earlier, I uh, run Daily MTG. And Dino's soon, coming I'm again. going to be on e. streams more often because we're working on uh, a weekly stream. Uh, he said that confidently. Wizards of the Coast and hosted by me for some reason. Also very confident. Nate doesn't get the Blake joke. And I are uh, old guard coverage. People. Very, very old guard. So when we <laughs> let people know we were doing this, one of the first tweets was, "What is this? A GP in 2011?" <laughs> and that was that was accurate. That was funny. Yeah, between you, me, and then uh, Mike Rosenberg, mm -hmm. who like all got hired on like within months uh, of each other, basically. Time, yeah. yep. Oh man. I don't know if these guys hang out very much together. Any news on draft or Amon? They don't have that good chemistry. Keys. I have uh, some news on some of the beta keys stuff in terms of invites. Um, uh, no, I'll take that damage. Um, Hands slow. They are turn two Raptor Hashley would have been better. Daily, and we're building up. Yo, MS a, Jonathan. Uh, yeah. What up? Try to get Mrs. More Jonathan into the game. Uh, like the like I said, last week uh, we downtime a few weeks ago added a whole bunch of server or, or well, a whole bunch of back end infrastructure that will help us put more people in the game and there we go. Uh, Costa Rica we are building up to a, an event that bet you it's warmer there than it is here it's so, freaking cold here um, for a whole other week I'm sick of it still need to be decided <laughs> uh, no attacks anyway. Look at that board Nate Scott. That is going for polyraptor combo. Yeah. That is Craigasm board state for Nate. <laughs> Holy moly. The metagame in just I hate everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How's it feel? I mean, I can block it. I got a captivating crew. I also have a third sailor means. Yeah. Booyah. Third sailor means solves, solves the carnage tiring problem. Gulp. <laughs> Should have barraged Odepec. Block with target oh. Raptor. Was the choice between Absolutely. barraging and casting Raptor Hatchling? Because that's... <laughs> have Vona's Hunger in the deck. No, there is no Vona's Hunger. There should, the I, I do have a Vona's Hunger now. I probably should update the You should update it. In it. So that's a, that's a good call out. One, two, three. So I, can, I mean, I just, can just play sail, the just sailor, play sailor means. means. And... He can do six damage. Quad, quad block no, seems good to me. Can. Uh, I can't, can't. I don't have enough mana. Yeah, so you can either barrage the hunt master. <sighs> no, nope, we're, we're just gonna. Or just accept your fate. Yep. Accept your fate. Accepting, is a solid, accepting it's a fate. Solid play. Hold mm -hmm. on. Look at that. He's gonna emote. Nice. I'm waiting. I want a nice. Oh, Galta. <laughs> That's uh. <laughs> That is also a thing that can be done. On a positive note, it also doesn't have haste. 
I mean, clearly now. <laughs> guess, guess we should have killing, killing that other Peckon's master seems like the right line. Because this is just a huge amount of damage. All right, we're switching decks after this. So this, is, this is not a good week for uh, for the deck of it. Uh, rip the to delete deck uh, in MTG Arena. Clearly, it's not anymore. Me, you can, I mean, you can kill the Carnage Tyrant. I can. Like, <laughs> like that. I, is nah. It, no. No. He's not going to give up yeah, those sailors. It means <laughs> they live <laughs> on. The, de- on. the oh, mate may have lost. The sailor <laughs> means live on. I agree. This deck needs Thona's hunger. Now he's starting to tell Nate how to build Do Not Delete. Do, are you, you it says don't Do Not Delete. I, I'm, I'm considering it. Okay. <laughs> you could just play a different deck. You don't have to actually delete the deck. Oh, man. Let's see. Uh, Brace yourselves. I mean, too much shaking on head. Are you kidding me? You hit Let's me keep with the testosterone Delta. levels down here, folks. Much. Yeah, that was... Like, I, I am personally in my I know, bones beard. shaking. Stream oh. crash! Stream na- crash! Stream crashers! Stream crash! Stream crash. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's up? What's going on, friends? Hi! Hey! Hi. Are you guys grills! Doing We're doing out. We're doing That's cool. Cool. Real live grills and magic! Holy moly! That's awesome. What? Which of the, which of my awesome decks would you like us to Do play next? Do not delete. For we, no, no, we're, no, no, no. We literally almost deleted no. that deck. So. <laughs> That's it's, the funniest joke got, on the stream. Megan and, and, twice. Megan and Maria are here. Everybody, mm-hmm. say hi. What's up, team? So right, that's Maria Bartholi. They never say her name, but it's her, right? And Megan, who I didn't find a picture of online because I didn't know her last name. So sorry to Megan. How's it going? Hi, friends. Crashing our stream. Yeah. I, told, I definitely yeah. want you to play Totally Not Vampires. It's for that, sure. It is not a vampire. Deck. That is Maria's totally voice. Not not. Dead no, to rights. It's, it's, like it's, it's, Reg- it's Registar Alpha. How could yeah. this be a vampire deck? I don't deck? believe you. <laughs> <laughs> Your colors are white and black. Megan Wolf. <laughs> white, <laughs> white, black vampire. Vampires, uh, yeah, obviously. Or dinosaurs. Yeah. They're, oh. they're it's, white, it's, di- it's, white yeah. dinosaurs. It's Tetsamok, Kinjali, some wing control. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's see it then. You know what you're telling us? If you really want to control We'll just take it into the queue then. Let's take a look at this. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's clearly not a vampire deck. How are you guys doing? Great, great. Yeah. Good, good. Yeah, we're just hanging out. Having fun? Yeah. Quoto? We are playing as Quoto. Quoto. All right. Oh, goodness me. Uh, Forward it. Guys no, we do We do every second. The, uh, Magic 101 project. MS Jonathan. Wow. We do every wow. second yeah, of this stream. Something oh, while you're, I know, right? Oh, wow. Yes. I wonder so why they to. crashed the stream. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that no, it's weird. PR we flew out to Seattle. Yeah, we started a new series called Magic 101 on our YouTube channel. Right, sh- YouTube.com sh- sh- slash um, which is two, only two episodes in right now, but it's going to be a lot of videos teaching people the very, very basics of magic. So, like, what is a land? How do you use it to tap for mana? How do you cast a spell? So if you're looking to teach a friend or something like that, hopefully it'll be a super good resource that you can point them to to get them in on the very basics of magic. Yeah. And our hope is that you don't have, that way you can do all the exciting stuff, like play your friend in magic, and you can point them to us to be like, hey, Tell me, what is magic? Yeah. I don't like this very much. It's just, yeah, too many too many chefs in the pot or whatever. Too many cooks in the kitchen. They're all pretty fine by themselves. If I had to rank them, it'd be Nate, Maria, because I know her, Megan, and then Blake, number four. Um, well, see, here's the thing about the shameless plug. Like, this makes me think that the new new player content in Arena might be terrible. And that they're hoping people will watch these videos to learn how to play Magic before they get into Arena. And that's pretty scary to me. An intro to the game has to be in the game. You can't expect someone just to log on and know how to play this game from watching videos from a different site. If that's their new player introduction plan, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I mean, we come from duels, which is still, in my opinion, the best 
way to learn magic you can, really. Or the best that's ever been realized. People who see their friends playing MTG Arena. Yeah, I mean, they can't forego our tutorial just because they have this website. I'm all for the website and teaching people magic and all this stuff. That's fine. But if they're going to use it as a crutch or rely on it, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Also, this deck is definitely vampires. It, what are you talking about? No, there's like one vampire. <laughs> yeah, that's come on a, now. That's a pirate. This is such a good control card. I did say this was a control deck. So Blake's yeah. out so, his team right yeah, now. This is a pirate. Like, it what won't is last he long. belong in a vampire. Oh, You're cr okay. Stop. Okay. You're crazy. <laughs> Moment of Craven just depicts a vampire. Boot <laughs> uh, him. You're going to boot him? Uh, yeah, this is, this is also, it's Murph. Well, I mean, I want to, like, if he's got a deep, if they have a deeper water. This is the same thing I was saying about Dire Fleet Daredevil. Kite sail freebooters the same. With the Merfolk still being a large part of the meta, it's just not a very good card. And though it is a very good card, it's just not in this meta. Because Merfolk is just a brick. Even though I think he gets deep root waters, and sometimes you can, but overall it's a brick. I can't That's, win ever, yeah. so like, we have to, we have to... Oh, we called it! <laughs> I agree, Jonathan, but... Oh, sweet. That's nice. That's a, we ended up having... If you don't like, even know what the buttons do, how are you going to play? And uh, like was just literally standing behind me, so all you get is like the, like, yeah. the mid portion <laughs> of him as he comes in to steal a chair and then walk He's away. He's also so. 12 feet tall. So. He is. He's one of like, there's like three people in the building who are taller than I am. Three or yeah. four, and he's one of them, so. No, oh, must be nice. Do you all have meetings? All right. So Blake is a short person. I like people of all heights, but I will say the ideal height to be a man that is heterosexual is probably 6'2". I'm six feet tall. I feel like I could use an inch or two. Nate is 6'6", six, six, which I think is too tall. At that point, you're starting to lose some benefits of being a tall male. You're starting to bonk your head more. You're kind of getting towards too tall and stuff like that. But in terms of the dating scene in general, I think it's advantageous to be a taller male than a shorter male. Sorry, guys. I just... It's not my fault. I'm not women. So, yeah, I mean, you know, I just think it's harder. And it's just... Yeah, it is real talk. But um, I think Nate is past the point. Like, I don't think Blake should be as mad at him for that because Nate is past the point of really just, like, pure benefit from height. And he's starting to get some of it. Like, all the time, maybe some people ask him, do you play basketball? You know, that's got to be annoying after a while. But, like, 6'2", I think in terms of getting the ladies, is perfect. California 6'4", you're getting too tall, California. Stop growing. Bonking your head too much. All right, let's move on. Tall meeting. Tall meeting. Uh, <laughs> what we need to do is we need to have like like a high five circle around. Uh, yeah, I'm sure you really need to do. just get, get like all of it, like me, Trick, Tayback, and I'd like one or two more inches, Beard. Uh, I got I got a deep root waters, which oh, yeah. okay, okay. They hellowed me. I got a hello back. Oh, that's cute. It's very kind. Well, I'm <laughs> Which is reasonable. I mean, it's. I like some of the reactions when they're all together, when he gets like spikes wild cards. Everyone gets excited. I like that part. The immortal son. Yeah. Ninja. The lady slayer. Right now, yeah. These are the the default ones. They are always the son, and I am always Watley. Or that's true. I don't mean to generalize about South American people, but they are generally shorter. You're always defeating an inanimate object when you play them. So all all that talk scales accordingly. <laughs> yeah. I mean, not our opponent. Our opponent's playing Merfolk. That that's clearly something. They're that, the heroes. Yeah, they're the, the heroes. Story. Exactly. <laughs> Merfolk are not heroes, people. Was, it was the dinosaurs that won control over us, though, right? Uh. Yes. The shaman. Yes. Yeah. yeah. The dinosaurs won control. Yep. <laughs> There's that some more I didn't vote, know. How could you vote otherwise? 
That was a, a oh, very man. fun. I love those pants. <laughs> I love those pants. Okay, no. you, if you read this, look, Vona is. Vona is really Vona, cool. Vona is sweet. But she's, she's so mean. Alondra. She's real mean. The dust cloud. I mean, you can double moment this turn. I can. I understand that Costa Rica is in Central America. But it applies to South America, too. And I'm sorry that I wasn't clear on that point. I pretty much say anywhere Mexico on down. I don't have the data, but those people are shorter on average than people in America. And I'm sorry for grouping those two together. And two moments? Or you could just think yeah. two moments. Uh, I actually don't. Yeah, I don't really want to do. I don't think uh, I want to vanquish. Yeah, Shard is from the land of tall people. Those point, Nordic like, people get tall. Another, yeah, well, I'm going to need to. Is an, or, at least one their island. Hand is, it's two islands because they started on an island, yeah, 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 drew yeah. two islands off the Jade Light, so their hand is two islands and something. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to play this. And I am going to. I mean, he's got a pretty send a message. Well, good hair, but that's right now. It's not a vampire's deck. It, like I said, it's a it's a dinosaur control deck, and there just aren't very many control dinosaurs in black and white. So. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. You have okay. The I think I built this deck. I think I remember building this deck when I had a quest that was about killing people's creatures, and I don't know if it actually is intended to win games or just help me complete a quest, oh, but. Wow. <laughs> In all fairness, I sounds I, like the me thing with I deck building. The most in uh, in this game is let's do this is coming up with clever deck names for my deck. He's very good at that. Intended to achieve He's a very, very good specific that. purpose. I like how you can see um, the little graveyard situation. Let's look at it here. Yeah, click on it, shows you what's there. You can see their exiled cards too. It makes a sweet little. Uh, it little. even shows you where it is. It goes back down, hides underneath them. Yeah. Ooh. So people uh, that card. It's it is. It is. I, we it want needs our, to stay there. Uh, yeah, forever. We can't we can't beat that, that is, card. That card is easily <laughs> the best card in any Merfolk deck. It's a real good card. It's real good. I I drafted it a fair amount. Yeah, I, I actually think I can't. Sometimes it was a bad idea. I've been playing it in standard. Oh, well, they're in standard. Are you playing Merfolk? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How is it? It's pretty good. It's, uh, my build's a little different than most that I've seen. It, it relies pretty heavily on Deep Root Waters. Um, Play Merfolk and Standard. This guy's got some balls. Goes big with, uh, what's his name? The Tyrant. No, I wouldn't do that, that, man. Some, someone in You're yeah. Costa Rica, you man. you have a commander deck that has Kamena as the commander? Yeah. <laughs> Kamena's great. Yeah, it says draw a card on it. I mean, I like it. It All does right. say draw a card on it. I'm like disembodied head coming out of your shoulder. What you don't know is that that is also what I actually am. <laughs> <laughs> we, uh, we're two at a giant uh, partners, but like... But always. Always, always. yeah. There's <laughs> no other way it is. All right, what do, I, what do I do here? I've got three Let removal play. spells and three things to kill. CGB do says... Do I kill both of them and keep battling? Can't do worse. Do I like play these two, kill off? Uh, mm -hmm. these two things. Carnage Siren. Uh, that was the card you put in there. We're gonna battle. We're gonna, we're yeah, gonna combat. Battle. We're gonna attack and we're not gonna make any decisions. I mean, the 5 0 deck had four deep root waters. Yeah. I'm not using the binding. Thinking. No, 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 no. <laughs> no uh, that resolves. That's fine. Oh no, it's a blocker though. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> not if you kill all of the other Merfolk. What is your top end in this deck? Okay. Their hand is. I don't remember. An, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> their hand is an island, so you okay. can just start killing things. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Right? Yeah. They've only played one of those islands. We Blake, win this race, right? Blake keeping the track of the reveal cards for him. We have a moment of craving. That's nice. That's math yeah, is in our favor. That's not, that's not how that math works. All right. Well, let's start by. I'm, gosh, what, what do I want to vanquish? That's all instant so speed. I I vanquish. The I don't know if he needs to do. It. Oh, that's the other guy's turn. Never mind. Oh, he's running the clock. I'm gonna vanquish a herald. Get back at No it. free pip for you this turn, Nate. Craving I'm gonna crave the flyer. The flyer. Yeah. yeah. I'm just gonna do it now. <laughs> wow, CGB's got the jokes. Offset. Okay. All right, all right. Wow, this deck. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't joking. Like, I did right. think. Kill your 
opponent with a single kite sail freebooter. I mean, it's working. I mean, it's <laughs> working. It by, by the working, I mean, like, if I removed both of our opponent's things, do which we, I can't do on this round, I'm going to man. Are finding the Jade Light Ranger? Um, that, I mean, it's, their, it's probably their best value card. Yeah, no, that's that's reasonable. And that's Kumena, reasonable. we can take care of with rebrand. Yeah, that's that's value. Value. Which it will. Yeah. <laughs> Look at Nate. Look at Blake convincing Nate to hate on someone's value card. That's so unlike Nate. All right. It's being the bullied. One point race is on. You the don't hate on value you cards when you're Nate Price. If they draw a Vine Shaper Mystic. That's bad, bad, bad news bears for us. Oh, man. Oh, man, such value. Ooh. Our deck doesn't work against this card. Right. Against 1-1 one, one hexproof merfolk token. I mean, you, <laughs> you can block it with your 1-2, oh, yeah, I mean, shh, shh, but then the race is off. <laughs> Ooh, another kill now. Uh, it is not my quest this week to kill things, either. <laughs> it's, it's <laughs> Uh, the, I have, I have, like, a, I have to build a black-red deck, or I can play, I can win a game with uh, the blue at Burbs deck I've got. Yay. Burbs. Um, Ladies like me, the Burbs. Me. Do we need to slow down? Is Keep that, that in mind, people. Here? Ladies like the Burbs. Kill off both of these things. And You're wait. making your new deck choices with the, after the wipe. No way, we're going to... We're going to choose Burbs for the ladies. Guy, and then we're going to fight. Yeah, yeah, get in there. Keep sending that message. Keep going. We mean business. Fifteen uh, turns from now, we're winning. I feel yeah. real bad because, like, if I, I kind of want our opponent to be watching right now, because there are things I want to do, like, not to be mean spirited, because I think they would be funny if the other person was also in on the joke. <laughs> but like, when they're not, they come across as terrible, which is like a life lesson for the internet in general for most people. Mean, there like, are a lot of things that might sound great to you, internet. but <laughs> devoid of context, are not great. Click through your turn, Nate. Click through oh, your man. gosh darn turn. So we are not winning. This. Uh, only mathematically. <laughs> Good point. Spiritually. Spiritually, we're ahead. The vampires were... Not vampires. Oh. There are no vampires here. There's no vampires in this deck. Not a vampire deck. No, there's been a single vampire. Does he draw it next? Does he draw the card of cards? Next draw? See if he gets it. Oh. Guess we gotta wait one more turn. It's okay, we're not, we didn't draw it this turn. The opponent. collective sound of disappointment. You could put lands that draw cards in here if you're not gonna be doing anything. Teachable anyway. lesson. I, I don't have any arches. I can't, California, of, uh, I'm too excited. Is Arch of Arras card? Is that what the card's called? Yeah. yeah. Man, not doing coverage for as long as I have makes me you really bad at card names. Cards, yeah. 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 Anytime you've got a like what? Oh, they're thinking. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that so funny? Oh, that's, uh, that is no, also. Uh, really uh, yeah, I mean, we, every card in our deck still kills a two-two. Yeah. So. You're fine. Well, we're gonna put on the hex proof. Which is Probably. less good, but that still makes our blockers live. All the blockers we have. Well, I'm like the, the blockers bl of the land. Again, like we have cards in our deck that are creatures, maybe. Not just not vampires. No, why would there be vampires in no, this non-vampire deck? Uh, <laughs> Can um, Captain Eckhart sec, asks, "Does this deck actually have a way to win, Nate?" What's up? Did you screw up again?
My kid is sick at home, so I just need like one more minute. Yo, Adrian, what up? Yeah. Sorry about that, everyone. <laughs> he doesn't know. I don't remember. <laughs> like, I'm not, not even joking. Like, I remember oh. building this deck to try to complete this. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, a thing. Like this puppy. All right. I mean, this this gets crazy. Oh, I remember this deck now. This is the deck that's got the galleon in it so that we can recur Ravenous Chupacabra over okay. and over again. All right. That's our that's our way to that, win. That is our Galleon. way. <laughs> I remember now because Marshall was in on the stream and someone was talking about how bad the galleon is. I'm like, no way, this card is insane. Look at all the value that it gets. And Marshall's like approved. So like, I have Marshall's seal of approval, which means I can't be wrong. I don't think, I don't think anyone at Wizards likes name dropping more than Nate Price. Man, he loves name dropping. And then the whole conquer is like, he said value like three times there. <coughs> Yo, bees, what up? Yeah. You already missed your shout out. <laughs> it is not what that means. Uh. <laughs> oh, is that animation the summoning stick animation? I remember uh, from the previous the, week. The, little, the whip ripple. I was sitting yeah. there like, a problem like is it you know, like, <laughs> a heat wave? Yeah, it's just really hot. Yeah. It looks oh, like boy. sometimes if you film a TV. Yep. Oh. The yeah. frame, the refresh rate. Yeah. 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 Nope. <laughs> it could just be an animation of whatever that card is, like throwing up. That I think that. would accurately portray the sickness. Are you down with the sickness? <laughs> okay. Let's hold on. Hold on. Just a couple. No. Get back. <laughs> get back. <laughs> <laughs> the race is still on, folks. He is. Guys, just gotta, gotta get him to slow, slow down. The race is yeah. totally on. We are um, a few turns away from turning the corner. Four-headed giant. Another two-two. Uh, that's fine. That you can ambush. I mean, I can also just block it. We're gonna draw something well, at some point, want, right? You want to block the hexproof deck? I do, but like. Oh, okay. Get him okay. And see. Okay. Boot. Show me the lands in Boot your hand so I can keep. All right, yep. so an island, island and a fort. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fail to find. Yeah, I think that's the right play. Oh, Thank you. you. Don't want to Booters <laughs> and dire feet daredevils just <laughs> whiff, man. <laughs> it's a lot better than if it was just one button to fail to find. Like you just feel bad every time it happened to you. Uh, we are gonna still attack with this one. That way we don't make a mistake and accidentally block with it at some point. Smart play, Nate. It's a good play. <laughs> our, our win condition are two one two flyers. I mean, that's a valid a win condition. All the blocking. I mean, all right. There's the forest. Come on, scratch that one off of our list that we wrote. Oh no! Top deck jungle lord pioneer. Uh, I'd be have, pissed. Have enough two -twos to I'd be pissed to know that that guy just top deck jungle born right pioneer. One. I think there's one of those in this deck. It's a really good card for him right now. Chupacabra would be your best draw. Like, I am really worried about Kumena, so I don't want to... You know they have it? Uh, like, uh, they have no, to. No, it's just... At some point. 
I, I don't want to use the ambush until I have another card. I really don't want to. I'm just going to take the two. Yeah, that's fine. We got. We still have some life to play with, and this deck does gain life. It is a dinosaur control deck after all. So. <laughs> I think well, we have yet to see. There we go. Oh man. Uh, Best oh, draw ever. Paid <laughs> off. Should we cast like all four Moment of Cravings at this point? I don't know. Like, should we should we be just so three? Well, we, that might be all that I own. Also, <laughs> <laughs> four, eight, ten. Uh, we have yeah. They've dealt us twenty damage. Well, well. So what? Oh, hold on, hold on. We turned the corner. We're now there, Blake. We, we are officially ahead. Nice. Yay! We're our opponents on a five-turn clock. <laughs> There's the island. Uh, we don't know what the opponent has in hand anymore. That. We're all about speed today. Yeah, this is <laughs> only, only the <laughs> finest. Is that to Atli glowing because he was excited to be ahead? Uh, I think it's because like, he's waiting oh, for That was a really good joke. <laughs> yeah. Ouch. Harsh, Nate. No. <laughs> you shouldn't be talking about good jokes, uh, Nate. You should not be the one. <laughs> <laughs> Made her feel bad on stream. <laughs> Messing with the right, grills. We block. Boo, um, Nate. Boo. I will block here. And I will block... Which one? Which one? I don't think it's here. I mean, it might. They might have a bounce spell. Like, mm. There is someone in the chat with the same name as uh, Q. Oh, man, you're here? Are you here, friend? Ghost! Where are you? Where are you, friend? Cordo, no! No, Cordo is here! He's ghosting. Oh, that's great. oh, now that you're here, I can do the thing that I wanted to do. That's great. He's ghosting. <laughs> Come on, man. Show some class. Right, oh. now, now, this is mm. the, one of the only vampires <laughs> in the deck. <laughs> no, look! <laughs> look, I'll show you. I'll that's show you. So we'll even look through the deck and you'll see all of the... Look at the deck. I, we're going to take the action just to show... It. First, we're obviously taking all three of them. Opponent said hello totally after he got a shout out so in let's chat. Go through and look at the creatures we got. See, entirely not a vampire, ghosting the entire not a game. vampire. Come vampire. on, dude, no, play fair against me. Makes a dinosaur. Thank you very much. Um, vampire. I don't know. You guys are crazy seeing things. Vampire. Vampire. As, so this is the whole deck. You'll notice, like, I literally don't really have a good way to win the game. <laughs> uh, yeah, you really don't. Okay. This is, this is a bishop. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Since Quoto's here. <laughs> Complimenting yourself. Uh, oh, goodness me. We're in some trouble. Just cast all the two twos. I can't. I can only cast two of them. I think the vampires were too much for Blake. Where is the galleon? Ah, I see what you're getting at, California. I don't know. Maybe we missed it. But I feel like Blake is turning the corner here. He was, he was with Nate. He was saying there were no vamps. He was helping him through the gameplay, and at this point, Blake has now turned like 180 and is on the anti Nate team. Maybe that doesn't really come till the next deck, but this could be the point where he turns the corner. Uh, hold on. You see, look, let's go look at the deck again. No. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> <laughs> Don't care. All right. Yeah, you've drawn a lot of lands, my friend. <laughs> this has been. <laughs> this has been. This has been a game. Conquistadors <laughs> seem pretty good here, Brad. <laughs> Uh, I like these conquistadors. They seem like gr a great pull. <laughs> Since I've been reported for slow play, that's that's reasonable. I can't I can't I can't argue with that. Well. All right, combat. Uh, whatever. Get in there with everything. I think I just get in there with everything. <laughs> nice. Nice. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Why don't you have an emote for Huatlu that says, must be? <laughs> Dusk Legion Zealot doesn't count, people. Like, any, any suggestions you have for emotes, <laughs> by all means, please must send them. It's, it just starts with Ixalan, but they'll be adding our, the uh, Amonkhet our and our Devastation really, block um, on next Thursday. So there'll be four sets. Uh, we've got a couple people asking about news on the NDA list. Yep, we announced that earlier. Uh, the NDA lift is going to happen uh, after the update on the 22nd of this month. So that's next, next Thursday. Thursday, a week from next Thursday. tomorrow. Uh, as Nate said earlier, don't record stuff now and then share it. Uh, that NDA lift only covers any gameplay that happens after the update on the 22nd. 
<sighs> How about an emote that what can express it, frustration? Good game, friend. Good game. Gets that, the that win. Was a lot of, <laughs> Gets that was a win. lot of lands, but I'm super happy that she came into the chat to hang out for <laughs> a while. <laughs> uh, what? Better. The worst deck we've played with today is the only one that's won. What are you talking about? This deck's great. Mm. <laughs> All right, Burbs it is. Burbs. Burbs. See, is already calling it the worst this deck? This deck is the most face rolly deck that I've built. It's Blake the only, is, like, real aggressive deck. He's turned the corner, too, so. and he's starting to yeah. piss me off. R.I.P. to the Flood. Cool Leave Nate alone. Good sports. Big fan. So, Blake, what are you saying? Are you saying that we can record this next Thursday or stream? Yes. After next, after next after Thursday. Thursday. Nice softball so the question. Update, the update will take. It will start in the morning, so the servers Burbs. will go down uh, on the twenty second in the morning. Yep. Uh, so you won't be able to play for a little bit, but as soon as the servers come back up, uh, whenever that is, uh, that is your. Cue I think so, to Ninja. Start creating content, streaming. Uh, basically showing off, you can discuss stuff publicly, which hasn't been an option yet. It has been so hard, like, mm -hmm. not talking about things as we work towards this. It's also like, the, so we made these creator kits. I've like, seen that some people have gone and downloaded them. Um, They're this watching is like you. kind of a beta for us. We're, we're testing some of the creator stuff. Um, so if you guys have feedback about some of the things that we've been giving people, please, by all means, let us know. Um, like it's basically a bunch of uh, overlays and screens for people who are um, streamers, uh, as well as like a best practices guide that uh, we we culled from people who are streaming and making video content. And uh, Ooh, that card says draw a card. It does. Um, I approve. Do you want me to put it on I this one? I think you should put it on that one. You realize if I sacrifice it at some point, I lose. You're not going to need to. You're going to play the other Siren. Nice. This Congratulations, this Jonathan. We're going to get. We're going to get. Anyway, right there, they do say they are taking feedback on these overlays. We discussed them a little bit. You guys should download them and check them out, or you can watch the beginning of the stream. I display one of them. But I think they could use some feedback on these overlays. I think the general idea of them is cool, but they could use some feedback. So you people who know about art, get in there. I can't really say anything. The other thing I would say is I'd like the game capture part bigger. We're going to... And then the little one's going to protect the big one. I mean, eventually. Eventually. I would like to take that action. The tribal nature of the Ixalan block does make it easy kind of to build a deck that What? It's not a discard? Well. No, it's just curiosity. Man! This a, I knew I'd... <laughs> that card's great! <laughs> <laughs> I just always assume there's a downside Luke, to the things that are like uh, nothing but positive the, for me. That's, downside, that's what I've been, mood I've been in this week. There's obviously got to be something bad when something good is There is a happen. downside, but it's, it's that you have to attack every turn, otherwise you sacrifice uh, the enchantment. All right, so uh, we're just, can I, can I get approval to just right? fight people and play the This could come landing, back up in the yeah, top well, five, California. Take action. All right. Well, oh, I, I, think, I think we landing. I think it's landing and, and storm, storm tamer. tamer. Yeah. Go, burbs, go. We got to protect the All curious the burbs. <laughs> We've drawn all of our burbs. <laughs> they, can't, they can't touch us ever. <laughs> oh, man. People. I know. So is the deck truly blue? <laughs> you ask me, no. This it's is drawing cards. Yeah, Lee's in, Lee's in chat right now. Hey, Lee. Shard um, Course and Curious Obsession. Uh, I both draw cards. Oh, uh, uh, you should probably counter that. I will. I would like to that make that not happen, please. Please and thank you. Well done. Well Lee, done. Um, I countered the heck out of that savage stuff. Blue deck, in your estimation, <laughs> as the world's one of the world's premier red mages. I don't want to give you the title because P. Sully still exists. Um, is this an acceptable blue deck? I am just going to give him the land trigger. Yeah. Ninja's <laughs> big on the blue-white flyers. I didn't really land. see that part, Ninja. I apologize, but I'm sure the deck is sweet. It does feel real nice. Let me know, if, let me know what Lee says. It's very important Lee has not yet responded. Of course he has. And he's thinking. It's a moral quandary for him. It is. What did he attack in with there that died and that gave him a, a land? Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. What was that? Banned. Wow. Banned from the stream. That seemed like a bad you attack. Say, wow, over and over again. Wow. 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 
Oh, okay. Ooh, that's, oh, that's nice. a good one. <laughs> that was in combat. The freaking peanut gallery is, like, no, I don't know. That way. I, I know it made the stream a little crazy. You, you like Glyph Keeper? I didn't like Glyph Keeper in duels. I wanted to flip Legion Landing and flip the token. All right, that sounds fine. I mean, we can't, we can't do that. No, no. we got to end the turn. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds fine. You dive down. The tech will keep you at all costs. Maybe. I don't know though. How much land is this guy working know, with? He would have been still at four land. Yeah. <laughs> he had a drover. I guess he could pretty much play whatever he wants. <laughs> One of my favorite I don't know, Jason Tan. Like I like Gabby. Places. She's all right. That's all I can give Gabby. She's fine. Every time it's a lift, it's and I don't know who Jason Tan Basically is. Perfect. Gabby's not my favorite, but uh, she's good. Waits that like compliment you as you're lifting. Wow. <laughs> wow. Great job. There's a lot of streamers you can watch, yeah. you know, Burbs and it depends on like what kind of gameplay you like to see too. Like, do you like watching modern? Do you like watching standard? Do you like watching draft? <laughs> That makes a big difference on what kind of MTGO streamer you you watch. You have uh, I don't like attacking people. It feels wrong. <laughs> Next week you can find streamers that play arena if you like watching arena. No, no bad, bad, bad arena. <laughs> We're working on that. Don't worry. <laughs> He's talking about the land tapping here. Auto land tapping. What are you working on so that it would tap? So, know that you have a blue hand, card in hand. so like ninety nine percent of the time, you know, a large number, a large percent of the time, <laughs> it's cor it, it's correct and it recognizes that I've got like multiple, like blue activated abilities and spells, and so it'll keep up the island for me. But there's yeah. sometimes when it doesn't, it gets confused. Ooh, it gets confused. Ooh. 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 Oh shoot, I cut it off right there. Ooh. <laughs> um. He's only has one spell in hand and it's mono blue. It does seem confused the fact that it would try to tap both blues and leave open a white. I don't like that. That's a high level of confusion. I don't like it. Wow. <laughs> All right, so we're not done with the oohs and ahs, folks. Back. Just wait till he starts I'm cracking packs. Pack. I, I know that we've got like <laughs> we have a wipe coming soon. I'm just like, yep. don't care, cracking packs. Uh, buy it. get us the rivals packs. All right, all right, all right. Get, get ready. Can you chat whatever you like, or is it selecting from given phrases? Uh, it is just a very, very basic emote right now. So there's like five messages. We've that talked about this from before. As far as emotes go, you can squelch your opponent's It emotes. needs to be better. And we are looking for lots of feedback on those. I have... Ooh! Wow! Wow! wow. wow. Yeah. God, the mic is just distorting there. Like, oh, come on, people. Mic these people properly. I do not think Nate will be on the Pro Tour, but man, that's a lot of hype for Mythic Rare, though it is a good card. It's still the card I want the most out of any pack. Oh, that part's hilarious, too. <laughs> Let's do it again. Wow. Wow. Yep, 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 one rare, uh, a couple of uncommon. One rare or mythic, a couple of uncommons. And a bunch so sweet, of the best pull um, in the game, in my opinion. There's a chance for any of those things to be replaced with a wild card that you can redeem for anything. So, oh. so we can go in and make one of our decks. I know better, that story. Which I'm actually going CGB. to do right now. Um, we're gonna go. He's told that story. Better, because this deck oh, I is. I thought funny. it was like Dora because she's exploring. That is exactly <laughs> what. <laughs> what oh, okay. <laughs> I told you I like to make these decks. <laughs> I like. I also like the way that you're just like staring at me. Like, yes, I know this yeah. exact joke that I just made. Thank you. I'm bad. <laughs> uh, there's, a, there's a request uh. for the phrase. Woo! Blake's Woo! into this deck. Look at he's checking it's out those cards. Be a great addition. Woo! Woo! And then if it's different characters, like one could be like yeehaw. So <laughs> I like a woo. So can you pull up like rares I do not own, so yeah. you can kind of go shopping. Yep. 
Uh, I mean, it is basically. I don't have full. I don't have four of yet. You can yep. just click on the uh, the wildcard uh, thing, and it, it populates with anything that you don't currently have four of, including like as you can see a bunch of stuff that's great. Sure. Yeah, gotcha. So, um, I, I mean, that's I'm what I said. There's really no content in the stream at all after the NDA drop. There's one huge nugget at the beginning, and then there's just nonsense for the rest of the stream. J Light Ranger, I endorse that. Uh, I also, well, I'm gonna need to add a real fast. I need to add another black card because we need another Choop. Where are you, Choop? Oh my God, lurking Chupacabra. So full, con the full amount of Choops. Oh, you're lurking. <laughs> oh, we are. Oh, oh, we definitely oh, are. We always. Yeah. All right, so let's. Uh, I'm gonna switch what to happens if we change your mind after you buy that J Light Ranger? I mean, should have thought harder beforehand. <laughs> <laughs> Burn, but true. Once you spend those wild cards, you're not getting them back, folks. He said it's coming soon. He stopped using percentages and just... They said it was coming on Thursday, actually. It's coming with the update. I'm pretty sure that's confirmed. Graphical update, economy update, I'm a cat blocks. <laughs> it's too hard. It's too hard to All right. talk and turn. Why? Why would? Yeah. Why would you have it? Also, it's Jade Light Ranger. Why would you not want that card? <laughs> all right. Let's get rid of some. Let's get rid of one or two drops. You don't need all these dust weeds and zealots. They don't explore. They do. They Three do. X Grim Captains like, call, boys do. and girls. Like, my choice was like my choice is between dust weed and zealot or a Kai self rebooter, and I want to keep the I want to keep the boots. I think this is a bad call. You certainly don't need four freebooters. The door is right. The door is like so. Two. Do you want to take a look at all of my decks and? See that every single deck that I'm playing that is playing Swamps also has Grim Captains calling it, except for Do Not Delete, which is one of the reasons I should. Here we go. <laughs> I'm just saying. Did every totally deck. not vampires have? I didn't see Grim Captains. I have. It did. I'm, I'm sure that they I'm 99% sure this will not be the last wipe. And I'm not making this up mm. on the spot. Why are we not looking at it right now to prove this point? Because we got, we've only we got, got so we only have five, six and a half minutes oh, left. We, gotta, we, we, have, we have to play a game. So he's just going to, he's going to, yeah, not not suspect at all. It's too much. It's too much. I just want it to be known. Um, we did not win a game until you guys showed up. Well, so, true, true story. Thank yeah, you very much, and also, right. Blake, you suck. Yep. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> Ooh, shots fired. <laughs> beep, 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 oh, no, this, is, this sounds great. Yeah. yeah. So maybe there's a reason Blake turned on Nate, because Nate just told him he sucked. Hashtag <laughs> Let's see. We're going to do this one. That way our opponent thinks they don't know what we're on. They, we could be on anything. Yeah, I mean, like swamps. Significantly more restrictive. Well, I mean, it's obvious that if I'm playing yeah. a swamp first, I mean, it cuts first, it cuts them deeply. Actually, I'm not on I'm not on Do Not Delete, like the metagame defining yeah, deck no, of MTG Arena. The, um, <laughs> the only one we've lost with all day. <laughs> all right, well, let's uh, let's get a look. Let's get a look. See. Let's see how well got? this boot does. Oh no! Whiff. Oh no! It's the real version of our okay, deck. But their their man is bad. Yeah, Jund. well, I mean, so's ours. So. No, Jund I mean, good like, stuff. They, they can't cast anything except for free. Just food. wait. This is the. It'll just happen. Yeah, I'm really looking forward they to the fact that one of the things they're building is right, right now also is a, like a, a tool that will keep things revealed. So that like, mm. if you any like, deck that, that plays do dinos paper, automatically like, draws yeah, the proper the land. That's just the way it works. Because be I don't want to write things down. Get free booted. <laughs> Everyone is, is, already, is already like They talk yeah, about well, the reveal zone rip. there for a second. I saw that hand. Oh, here we go. It's coming. Find the way. Find the way, Kishana. This is wayfinder. Megan's just picking her ear right back mm, there. Graveyard. Yeah. I try to avoid that on stream normally. Send a message. I want him to start attacking. We got we 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 to get our blocker out of the way that our, way our opponent considers. Okay. Yeah, exactly. It's a very advanced play. <laughs> <laughs> Only the best. Oh, oh, they, oh they no! Drew the forest. Told you. They, drew the they forest. did top deck that like, forest nah, into J Light Ranger, bad. which should set yep, him up. Can't. Wait. Wow. <laughs> On a positive Lord. note, we had five minutes until we had to stop streaming <laughs> anyway, so at least we're going to get destroyed. Hold on. In those Maybe. Five minutes. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty nice. Hey, look at that card. We don't want to right now. Best card oh, in the deck. No interest in that card right now. <laughs> if only we had fewer in the deck, so we would maybe like draw it later, possibly. Uh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> this is where the Grim Captain's call hate comes. Uh -oh. You didn't induce him to attack. I induced a thing. You induced nothing. Oh, maybe, you maybe induced nothing. Maybe, maybe he time. took that sucks time. comment I got hard. Got mana available. Giant growths in this format. Nope. nope. Good call. 
They read it. Read it's the a decent trade. Well, that trade's fine with me. Right, yeah, California. He is together. going for the ambitious John Good, good stuff. How else are we going to get value on this insane late game Grim Camp? We're cool. not. Uh, we do have a question in the chat. Will we get Chris State of the Beta today? Uh, Chris will have more to say next week about what is. That's a different thing. And oh. the answer is he's working on it. Oh, okay. So, so yes. I'm a liar. <laughs> Look at that perfectly timed choop. Oh, man. Do I choop? You choop. Do I do I do I choop? Choop. choop. Do I choop? They don't even know which choop it is and yet. Then Jade Light Ranger, Dusk Legion Zealot, because I'm obviously gonna draw a land off the Dusk Light Ranger. Uh, Wait, why is it asking me to choose a tap? Oh, because it's into attack. Choop. Well, yeah. Yeah, it's the wrong choop. <laughs> wrong choop. Oh, we all we thought all it was the good chupacabra. Because why would you have the bad choop? Why is this choop here? Look, yeah. you're using choop that you need to put in a lot of extra effort for when there's another choop that will just straight up kill you. Just this is literally Maria makes a good point there. Like, yeah, but the other well, all right, no, no, no. Let me kill this creature. How many of you guys were in chat when we played this deck the last time and absolutely demolished an incredibly good game with it? Anybody remember that? Anybody remember I that? I do remember that. that. Yeah, well, no, that. Nobody remembers that. Well, it didn't I happen. don't remember that. They were there. <laughs> you were literally <laughs> here with me. What do you hey, mean? Um, it doesn't <laughs> could do anything. So would the other one. Nope. Uh, that's that's not that's not how that's not how it works. You know what the best part about it is? Is it's not a supported creature type of Grim Captain. I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not a supported creature type for Grim Captain's call. See, they're they're Whoa. not the people who remember. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. Oh, we're gonna get so there, there are way more people saying no. Well, no. I'm glad the Pepperidge Farm remembers too. That's <laughs> useful. It's true that uh, that Ripjaw well, Raptor well, would be well, dead if it was the other Choop. For the same mana cost. I have no memory of this place. Um, wow, if get, only they didn't have that Jaw Raptor because it had gotten killed. No. Probably Shard. Yeah, I haven't checked like, this morning. That, like a four mana removal spell? Yes. That also would have been good. Yeah. That would have been... That They're would have still been harping on the choops. Put that one in the graveyard. Nate's ignoring it. Yay. Okay, now we'll also play this. See, look, everything's coming up Millhouse. Mm. They did say that, but then why did he say uh, that? Uh, cost like a million mana, right? Chris Clay was working on it right now. All right. Oh no, it's gonna be a crazy stream next Thursday or next Wednesday. It only costs four mana, right? Cost ten mana. Cost six. Twenty. Twenty mana. I'm with that, CGB. It doesn't actually doesn't actually come into play. It just has that ability that lets you put counters on things. Yep. Thirty-five. Uh, so we. Are we ending at three, or are we ending when this game's over? We're ending when the game's over. Okay. <laughs> which is, which is Blake's so trying to get out of there. Yeah. He's had enough. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Uh, you got to stream well. next week, Blake. You better <laughs> get is used to it. the last week of PAX granted on Fridays. I actually don't know the answer to that. I'll be very honest with you. Um, maybe, maybe not. I mean, we usually... Stop picking on Nate. You should still get them. Stop picking you on him. You should get it this week, and I don't, I don't know what they're doing Ooh. afterwards. It's a good question for Clay next week. Ooh. Oh, man, what's that going to steal? Uh, that's the steel thing? Is that that card? Is this a steel guy? No. No. What's that gonna steal? Lol, Nate. What? Oh, that's nice. right. That's yeah. cool. Great. Yeah, life's good. We're obviously... Oh. Life's going real well. They don't have the city's button yet, so... Man. You're, you're open. They also don't have double red, which is... Which is the only reason... What card does even steals? Like, yeah. what is this... Is he talking about the Bishop of Binding? Yeah, it has a, it has like, what card is he even referring uh, to? It's not legendary. It's it's he knows what a Hashi's Taker he, looks like. Gosh, I don't, I'm trying to remember which um, indicator that actually is. Is that it has an effect during the upkeep? Uh, I can't no, figure it out. I, no, this is the Ascend ability. Uh, in any case, yeah, I don't know. It's a good question. Um, <laughs> this is a random bow tie. Th so right now they're talking about these... Um, what these little things mean on the card. And I guess the star somehow means flying. I never noticed, but all three flying creatures have that star indicator. I don't know why a star means flying. And the other one means ascend. And the claws mean enrage. But I don't pay much attention to those because I basically know what the cards do. But they're there. If there were some kind of guide in game, that would be helpful. There is a reason. I just don't know what it is because I'm not very smart. <laughs> so you're gonna stomp, stomp a dino on another dino? Or you could stomp a prophet. Or a prophet. No way, man. 
Right yeah, I'm with you, Nighthawk. <laughs> I hope they draw their second red wow. off of that. Not the, not this draw, but their draw for their turn. Yeah, because so now Blake just turns into a total dick, talking, cheering for the opponent to draw the second red to just stomp on Nate. Because that was obvious. Like that is what's going to kill us this game is the fact that I did that exact you're, thing right there. You're way ahead right now. <laughs> That's a good point. Can't possibly. The indicators are confusing. What am I thinking? <laughs> like, why do you even need a flying indicator when the card is hovering flying? Why do you need that indicator? It's clear that it's flying already. See? See? The plays! Play your second red. <laughs> you, got, you got it, Uncle Uncle Dragon. Second red. No, you gotta draw you gotta draw, draw into it. Draw it off here. Draw it here. Second red. What a douche. Nope, Stick with no your team, off. man. Alright. Uh, it's not how teammates act. act. Very yes. important. So So we lose next turn. Yeah. <laughs> Could be true, discarded. Did. Okay. I don't know. So there's a card. I defend Nate. Our opponent's hand and make him He's my boy. It's not in my deck, but is there is a card. I'm coming from a truly subjective opinion. Oh, I don't know. Let's, two of them. let's cast oh, it and find out. What does this card do, Blake? <sighs> the back and forth is Nothing. is getting. This is not how a team this is operates. Black ancestral recall right here. CGB wouldn't let his roller derby team get along like this. I select a vampire return. I will select a dinosaur return. What's this one? This one's a merfolk. It's a merfolk. Look at that. I just drew three cards. Yeah. Hold on. Anything else in the graveyard? No. All right. So casting the second one doesn't do anything. Very important to know. <laughs> Jesus. Because uh, <laughs> it doesn't get back chupacabras. Yeah, of course. Uh, we got to take advantage of the fact that uh, our raptor is uh, still in play. Sometimes when um, the board temporary. states get big, it's a little hard to see a lot high. of things. Like, we're actually not. <coughs> yeah, we are. <laughs> we're not losing. Maybe. Probably. <laughs> I wish there was a thanks option. Nice. <laughs> I like it as like a call and response. Yeah. Like, nice. nice. All right. Well, this is the office strike that wins the game for us, right? We have lethal on board. Uh, no. no. We do not. I mean. Yeah, no. He just kills off creatures, creatures just so he can get them back See, with Grim Captain's him. Call. This, this doesn't it. really value prove his point. Town. Yep. Hashtag value town. That one guy. I mean. I mean. Alright, we're gonna play another Dust Legion Zealot. Yeah, get this at it. Get this in play. Give our opponent another thing they need to kill. Which is a trick. A trick. We just <coughs> wanna make sure that we get the uh, the vampires <coughs> in the graveyard properly. We them. discussed that at the beginning of the stream. Yeah. 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 For a little while, Nighthawk and CGB. We're certainly not casting Grim Captain's Call. We can't get back three cards with it. <laughs> a Moose IRL says, I feel we need a sorry emote for when they top deck a card they can actually feel, can actually feel a little bad. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Uh, so just to let you know how general gaming culture has already viewed this, uh, that is the good game button, apparently. <laughs> and it is not nice. But nice. I see what you're asking for. You know what also is oh, yeah. nice? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, the, look, there's their nice. second red. Nice. Oh, there, that is their second one. Oh, Ooh, can't lose now. Oh, look at that back. Get it into play. Wow, he could have killed Tetramon. Hold on, hold on. Nope, you want to watch this? Kill, watch kill this. Freebooter. Yeah, get out of here. Oh, great. I'm okay. so glad that we're killing this freebooter. <laughs> Maria correctly points out that if that was rapid, <laughs> ravenous Chupacabra, <laughs> you could have just killed Tetsamok there. Uh, Which would probably have been a pretty good play. Hold on, what's on our game here? Oh, it's very important. No. <laughs> one of each. Is there one of each? I don't think it's a vampire. Whatever. All attack. Send a message. Plus, I need to... Yeah, it's right. I certainly don't think they should be releasing the NDA immediately after the update goes live. That seems like a terrible plan. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. When can we play a draft boundary to answer that question? Uh, I don't have an answer. Tax is done. Nice. That's what I need in my life. Oh. Angrath the Flame Chain. Oh, oh it's like wow. full, art. full art. Yeah, yeah. That's kind of sweet. That is totally sweet. This is what I've been saying about these cards from the beginning. That full art Angrath is badass. If it actually looked like the Planeswalker card on the screen now and it had all this goddamn text, you'd barely be able to see Angrath in the corner. But full art Angrath looks sweet. I like this. 
Hey. Well, no, look, he's And all it has is it's captain's call. That's really nice. Counters on it, which is all you really need. The thing is, is I think I already have. I think I already. They. This is yeah. This is a poor choice. This is a poor Why choice. Why do they not attack it? That's. Are they, they're protecting hand grabs. Okay. I get it. I get it. I understand you. They. They think they're protecting. Hand grabs. Like that's my ideal of. What, you what, display what, the art. You display the important information, and everything else is hidden no! unless you mouse over it. Oh, I should have seen that. <laughs> it's the way it should be, in my opinion. Ah, because the game is over. Because we're yeah, I miss flavor text, but <laughs> certainly you'd need some kind of side menu to access it or something. Here we go, boys. Look, how, look at the value he's getting. Yeah, the planeswalkers could be bigger, but once <laughs> you faced four Jaces, you understand why they can't be too big. <laughs> J Light Ranger. We're gonna mm -hmm. look at our cards. Card. Done. <laughs> <laughs> good game. Good game. Good, good game. game. Good game. Nice. Good game. nice. Oh. All right. Well, this has been fun. Thanks for thanks for stopping by, guys. Yeah. It's been fun. Yeah. You got to like Burbs. Burbs did a thing. You got yeah. to learn about the wonderful totally metagame shaping. Not. Totally not vampire deck. Totally yeah. not vampires. The successful. Totally Which one is metagame shaping? Deck. The vampire one or um, do not delete? Everybody who joined us in the middle and hasn't seen the exclamation point NDA thing already, um, taking the servers down next week on Thursday, Thursday the 22nd, um, to apply a massive update. A um, whole bunch of stuff being changed in it. And we, when they come back up, you will be able to stream, go forth, be merry, make videos, talk about things publicly, et cetera. Um, and Super excited to talk about things publicly. about that as well as download a cool intro um, kind of Check that out, guys, if you haven't. Video content creation kit at uh, Check out that link. Magic.wizards.com. Does it have a camera in it? Gosh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shaping and defining. Uh, would you download a car? Would you download a camera? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> anyway, it's uh, magic.wizards.com slash NDA drop. You guys should go check it out. Um, this is our first kind of foray into providing stuff like this. I know that there are other places people can go for this. We just want to give people who've never streamed before. It's cool. That is free. To making content a, a, a little bit of a leg up. Overlay is that good you have to pay for normally. And we're always looking for additional, that professional looking. additional advice. So if you guys find things uh, other than a camera that you feel would be useful or helpful, just let us know because we're going to be looking at changing and doing more stuff. There's a lot more to talk about about uh, other things that we are doing for potential creators in the future, but I have to work really hard to finalize all that stuff. It's basically what all of my time not streaming with you guys is spent on. So there will be more cool stuff for that. Tune in next week as uh, Blake is going to be taking over from me, hanging out with Chris Clay so that you guys can walk through. Chris Clay hype. You're walking through the update <coughs> like, so that people can see what it looks like before it actually goes live. Yep. So uh, Clay is going to give the walkthrough, talk about everything that's in it. I feel and, like Chris Clay uh, should be monitoring that update. With the pre-constructed decks that are a part of the update. So um, make sure you go in, claim your territory now. Tell him specifically which decks he's not allowed to, to play. I have to look at the deck list again. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, that's it for us today. It's been, it's been a full booth slash uh, studio slash room here. I um, appreciate it. Megan, you guys are awesome. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, high, 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 high fives. 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 Woo. <laughs> wow. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to head off. Uh, it's true, Blake, Nighthawk. Megan, Maria, Nate, so we've been having a lot of fun with you guys. We're overdue. i got a meeting literally to run to right now. So I will see you later. Go check out all of our stuff. Uh, join the conversation on social media, et cetera. Some other call-outs I didn't do. Go sign up for the closed beta if you haven't, and uh, we can stop broadcasting now. <laughs> there we have it, folks. There we have it. Boy, that thing was raucous. I don't know what to say. I wanted a date. He gave me a date. And then the rest of the stream was just out of control. Four people in the booth confirmed too many people in the booth. He speaks nerd well.